This is the true sequel to Predators. The true sequel to Predator. And you know what? This one's awesome. Predators is the true sequel to the Predator series, third film in the series, and it's also the fifth if you count the two Alien vs. Predator movies. This stars Adrian Brody, Alice Braga, Topher Grace, Walton Goggins, Lawrence Fishburne, and it tells the story here of, once again, these mercenary and a group of cold-blooded killers they are brought together on a mysterious planet and they become the prey of these aliens pursuing the ragtag humans through this dense jungle. And the group must work together to survive or they'll be forced to become the latest trophies of the fearsome intergalactic hunters known as the Predators. They pulled a aliens thing and call it Predators. So it's in, like an allusion to it. This movie, it I like this way more than Predator 2. I like this way more than Alien vs. Predator Requiem. And I like this more than Alien Resurrection. This was a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Let me just say, let me give credit to Robert Rodriguez. For deciding to come up with another idea for a Predator movie and decide to to make it go back to his roots. But also, so acknowledging the legacy of this film. And he honors it very well. He's the producer of this film. Now, Fox... They decide to right the wrongs and give us a true sequel to Predator. This, and and I, I must admit, I make up for you guys. I will give you guys that. Whew. The directing in this movie is off the chain. Nimrod Ansel, he did a good job directing. You get some great shots here. You get some awesome cinematography. Some Awesome kills, awesome editing, and it's just fun. You know, it's fun. The music by John Debony is incredible. I love the music by John Debony here. Is it is without a doubt it is great. Acting in this movie is great. Adrian Brody is great. Topher Grace is great. Alice Braga is great. Walton Goggins is great. Lawrence Fishburne's great. Hour and 47 minutes in, it doesn't feel like an hour and 47 minutes. It goes by quick. Except for there are, this one explanatory scene I feel like you could have removed. And I feel like the ending of this movie is kind of abrupt. Which is, are my two problems. And I was just like, huh? That's not pretty cool to me. But the four Predators are amazing. You have Classic Predator. You got the Tracker Predator. You got Berserker Predator. You got Falcon and Predator. And those three Predators are awesome. They are fantastic. This whole twist involving Lawrence, a certain character, I'm not going to spoil, but... Wow. Mm. Now, I did like the fact that they dismissed the two AVP films. And they decide the continuity of the franchise is the Predator takes place after the remaining films. And set before the events of this one. So that was pretty cool. But yeah, I have to say, Predators is a really true awesome sequel. 
It is way better than Predator 2. It is way better than Alien vs. Predator. It is way better than AVP Requiem. And despite the two little problems with the explanatory scene, the whole twist, and the abrupt ending, you have some cool action scenes, you get some good moments with the characters, you get some great acting, you get some good music, good directing, some entertaining writing, and just, it takes, yeah, this movie goes back to its full testosterone field roots, and I applaud this movie for that. This is easily my favorite of the Predator movies, and I can't wait for Predator 2. I mean, The Predator, directed by Shane Black, coming out in September with Olivia Munn, Boyd Holbrook, Keegan-Michael Key, Jacob Tramlick, and Thomas Jane. I can't wait for this. And who knows, if The Predator... If The Predator does well, the new Predator movie does well... There might be, two, we might have a trilogy of the new Predator films. So, yeah. And I'm going to give Predators an epitastic. Because this is an epitastic sequel. This is the real Predator movie. Let me know what you guys think of Predator down, Predators down below. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Let's get a friendly conversation going because there are a lot of people who are very divided on this movie. And I will see you guys in the next video. This is Future Filmmaker 39480 and you guys, as always, keep it cool.